In Let Me Study platform, you can create courses not only on IT but for different domains like art, music, management, etc. On every sale, you will get your profit on your bank account directly. Creating a new course on your platform involves several key steps to ensure that your course is well structured and appealing to potential learners. Here is a detailed guide on how to go about it. Step 1. Go to your dashboard and click on Create a new course. Log into your educator account and navigate to your dashboard. Look for the option that says Create a new course and click on it. This will be your starting point for crafting a new course. Step 2. Enter course title. After clicking on Create a new course, you'll be prompted to enter the course title. This is the first thing potential learners will see, so make it informative and engaging. The title should give a clear idea of what the course is about. Step 3. Then enter a brief description in the About Course section. In the About Course section, provide a concise yet informative description of what the course covers. Highlight the key topics and learning objectives. This will help potential learners understand what they can expect from the course. Step 4. Then under Course Setting, click on General and modify the difficulty level. Under the Course Settings, you'll find various options. Click on General to access settings related to the course's overall characteristics. Here, you can modify the difficulty level to accurately reflect the course's complexity. Choose from options like Beginner, Intermediate, or Advanced. Step 5, then add enrollment expiration in days. Specify the enrollment expiration period. This determines how long learners have access to the course after enrollment. Set a reasonable duration based on the course's content and structure, such as 30 days, 90 days, or even unlimited access. Step 6, select the relevant course category and then select the course price. Categorizing your course helps potential learners find it more easily. Select a relevant course category from the available options. Additionally, set a reasonable course price that reflects the value of your content. You can offer free courses or set a specific price depending on your business model. Step 7, then upload a thumbnail for the course. Visuals are essential for attracting learners. Upload an eye-catching thumbnail image for your course. Ensure that the image represents the course content and grabs the attention of potential learners. Step 8, then scroll down to Course Builder and click on Add Topic. In the Course Builder section, you'll structure your course content. Click on Add Topic to create the main sections or modules of your course. These topics will help organize the course materials. Step 9, click on Add Lesson. Within each topic, you'll add individual lessons. Click on Add Lesson to create lessons that cover specific subtopics or learning objectives. Each lesson should contribute to the overall course flow. Step 10, then give a name to the lesson and click on Update Lesson. After adding a lesson, provide it with a clear and descriptive name. This name should give learners a hint of what the lesson will cover. Once you have named the lesson, click on Update Lesson to save your changes. By following these steps, You'll be well on your way to creating a new course that's structured, engaging, and ready to attract eager learners. Remember that the quality of your content and its alignment with your learners' needs are equally important in delivering a successful online course. If you face any issue, call us on Trainer Support Services or write us on email.